Hornets trail Welcome by back, six Gilt on the court for Charlotte. Channel we Gilt up by six. Oh, oh, make that four. I get both solid Bobcats, the second seed, the ball in the locker room. There may be more athletic players around the league, but Steve, not many bigger ones. Ah, that's up. I'd like to see him even take advantage of that size more often on the offensive end. He'll be more aggressive. And so here's Cleveland after the basket by Charlotte. Just five on the clock. No good from Irving. No breathing room at all to take that shot. For Charlotte, they've gone two or three from the field here to open the second quarter. Kicks to Kyrie Gilchrist. Uh, we can take it with this. But he makes that shot. Bus. And LeBron face. Here's okay, LeBron. he can't even shoot. But he's off of LeBron in game. I thought his rebounding was impressive as well. As he made some big boards. Really helped out on the glass. Helped his team out big time. Now here's LeBron. Here's Taylor. Yeah! <laughs> Loving leaving the play wide open. That That's just a wide open slam. Game, the important thing is the two points, not the dramatic. Oh come on, Clark! He had to go for it, didn't he? Perhaps. I'm going with Kyrie. How Kyrie came off the body, but MKG came. Come on now. Who cares? Jefferson with it. He started by Verizal. I love like his block by Verizal. Irving kicks to Taylor. Nobody wants to move. Everybody want to run the play. He feeds it to James. And there's the three-second violation. And Stevenson's checked in for the Hornets. Hornets That's what by four. Run play. Takes it from ten. And the bucket counts. And well, of course, he gets fouled in his hand. On the Defense ground. played him close on that one, but he just would not oh be gosh, denied. Aggressive move for the score. Here's Irving. He's coming off a 16-point game against the Heat in Miami. You can James see this. The can't even set me to kick. Gilchrist comes with a double team. Shot clock at six. 11 feet away. The Umbo with the block. And Walker with a clear path to the hoop. And he misses the go-ahead basket. You know, typically, guys, he has the body control to finish when he's in that tight. I'm not sure what happened there. Good on the shot. Tried to hold the brown, but it wasn't letting him. He still get that shit. The number of points. And you saw me stand a wide open in the tank on that last play. Opening, and LeBron still the pulls up to get blocked. Defensively, I mean, they have to start shutting down some of those lanes to the hoop. Now here's Jefferson. He had 22 points in the win against Detroit. And don't forget the four blocks, so a huge game for him defensively as well. Oh, Maestro, he is so good at making those lead passes by conducting an orchestra. A moment here to take a look at some stats for Kyrie Irving. He's look at the court, that's you. Points a night, five assists, and rebounds. If it was an average player putting up those numbers, we'd say they were spectacular. Yeah, but and for how, him, simply run of the mill. And how much does that tell on, you about Brown. the talent he has? I mean, when the spectacular passes is average, that speaks volumes. Here is Verja after Al Jefferson's score. Can't hit from 12. Well, he's not necessarily a strong inside presence, but he needs to polish those chances off. Walker's shot is off. Cavaliers leading in transition. Here come the Cavaliers. Irving has got the ball. Offensive rebound. The Hornets have gotten just over Any 50% of their the shots court, to they in the second quarter. They're five for nine. The Ambo, the pass to Walker. James Come against on, LeBron Stevenson. jumping on a punk fake rip. Here's the teardrop. Irving attacking. Here's Taylor. Good, and the assist goes to Irving. 25 points for the kid. Oh, with that last title, you could see the coach was addressing how they were going to make a tactical adjustment. Four point the lead in the second half. Like it's on the I mean, players quarter. now to lock in and follow the lead and execute. If they don't, then the coach will put them on the punt. Now oh, here's Jefferson. He's got six. And it's off the back rim. No good. Really? It's three on three on the fast break. Here's Irving. 
Swig gets the whistle. Contact on the way up, and two shots coming up. And no question, he got both on that shot. Definitely no room for discussion on that one. The Cavaliers have gone five of seven from the free throw line in the game. And over the course of the season, guys, they've shot a very respectable seventy-eight percent from the line. One of the things they've done, guys, is taken pride in their out. free throw shooting this season, and rightfully so. Doris Burke has some information for us. Doris. Well, over that last break, Kevin, I got a chance to hear what David Blatt said to Let's the team. Let's see what they. Let's see what's up with They came over there. I'll try to find out. He talked about the second chance points that are out there if they work for them. He focused next on what he feels will be their most reliable offensive approach, which is the use of why he just while the ball just switch. That's a play we should be seeing a lot of. Maybe making those early adjustments will give them time to judge their effectiveness by halftime. We'll soon find out, Kevin. Thank you, Doris. A slight advantage for them in the rebound category. Start up to five. on the glass. Yeah, I agree with you, Steve. I mean, they're on the right side of the Come ladder, on, we need that all that momentum. That to them right I know we got the lead, but we need the momentum. Hornets trail by eight. Clark, some tough offensive sets. They want to turn it around. Yeah, Come on, we can't lose at home. Just to nah. some momentum here, Kevin. You got to get these fans a show and a they dub. This. Again, the miss Give me that board. Well, they the seeing the show by the kid. They seeing the performance. They seeing the performance. Fuck me. We up by 10. Doing a nice job of stringing together solid possessions and building that lead up. That's the key, Steve. They'll stay in control of this game if they can just avoid any lulls going forward. Here's Walker after the made shot from Taylor. Jefferson. Al just ain't off. doing it for him. He's missing a lot of shots out here offensively. He just has not been able to produce in this quarter. There's the double team with Walker. Out of, of course, I thought of him. Uh, takes possession. On Kevin Love with the now easy the cut to the basket. This is where teams look for a lot of their points, and these players, the highest scoring among them, have a got James. I'm a backer. Look at the kid leading the league in points per game. Such a great player. You got yeah, 23. I got 32. That jumps right out at you. Pretty much about to drop 60 in this game. That's better than any player in the league. If there's an opening, he'll find it. And the opening doesn't have to be there long, Steve. Just a nanosecond. I mean, that's the burst this fella possesses. Dang, that's like he got a speed burst. And he made it. And the Cavaliers with possession here. Let's see what we about to do. Outside Irving. Here's Taylor. I'm going to just pop the three. Off target with his three. I'm not out of the bat. He was close, shot, Kevin, to making know. the defense pay for lackadaisical coverage there. Yeah, he had a really good look. I mean, he'll knock that down. That was a good lay. I don't know what. Cavaliers right leading by eight. Oh, LeBron ran the same way I was going. LeBron drives in. Outside, Taylor. Pick by Verja. LeBron dishes to Verja. Yes, and it's LeBron. Well, that was the action. Maybe stay and press the shot button instead of the pass button. <laughs> like to get shots inside and That's all LeBron cutting. And Kid Gilchrist. But I actually pump fake instead of shooting it. I mean, passing it. Stevenson outside. All behind him instead of in front of him. Back to Walker. Outside, Kid Gilchrist. Walker in the post, covered by Irving, ejected by Irving. And that'll increase their rebound advantage. They've definitely been winning that battle on the ball. Oh, I didn't mean to pull the up. Thing is they have the bank is open. <laughs> that is always going to allow you to maintain your lead. Hornets trail by 12. Outside, Walker. They set the screen. Jefferson setting the pick for Walker. He kicks it to Stevenson. I uh, tipped it, but I couldn't grab it. For three. Ah, uh, nah. That's good. Ah, uh, nah. Right now. <laughs> single digits for the Hornets. It took him Man, a little while. Man, we were starting to move about to be about 20 in a minute. Now, he's definitely found well, his stride. Got that dude. This is play. Kid Gilchrist against James. The feed now to Irving. The tray. The shot will not go. Ah, oh, I wish I could have got that go the other way with it. Next up for them, the Knicks coming stop, out here to stop. play. That game marks the first half of a quick two-game homestand. Stevenson with a clean look and another three for Charlotte. They even got back-to-back -back three. We really lost a 12-point lead and like just that. Just at the right time, too, as really? they try to narrow the deficit. Taylor up top. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Stevenson. Oh, yeah. Taylor's shot good. <laughs> You know, he's showing some kind of a killer instinct this quarter, trying to stretch this lead out. You got 14, I got 31. 
outside, Walker. 107 left to play here in the half. Stevenson drives in, and there's the whistle fouled hard. Let me in, follow that, baby boy. That one on love. Stevenson, stuff in the stats. He's doing all sorts of things. He has 14 points, and he's they hit the, the whole lot of point range as well. Well, it's oh no secret. Gosh, I mean, the more points he can come up with from out there, the better off he'll be offensively with their spacing. Looking at who's out there now for the Cavaliers. Luis Scola, he's checked in for Parajan. Tristan Thompson comes in really? for Kevin Long. Long. Yeah. Waiters, he's checked in for James. And it's Matthew Delavidova in for Kyrie Irving. Oh, that was a good idea six. to leave me in with the bench. Vicious to Henderson. And Roberts kicks to Stevenson. Cranes it from beyond the arc. This sucker then hit three threes in a row. All these threes they're giving up have really been the driving force of this run. I agree, wow. guys. And the points add up in a hurry when you start giving up easy looks from long range. It's tipped. Score. And two free throws coming up as he misses that one. Drawing the whistle and a lot of contact there. This is his first free throw of the game. Well, he's right there at about 71% from the line this season. Probably somewhere below Walt, where he and they to be. the ball Guys, too. he is close to where he was last he year. He had about three threes in a row, and they saw the ball. still down just a skosh. Harrison, he's checked in for Charlotte. About that three seconds no between sense. shot and game clock. It's tipped. It's stolen by Taylor. Thompson, a screen on Henderson. Here's Taylor. Drops in the tray. Drop in the tray. Taylor's got a couple of three-pointers in the second for the Cavs. They can't afford to give him that kind of look. Well, it came off a good screen, but well, still. back up by eight. Defended. The clock runs out, and we're Start the video. You know, share it with your friends, yeah, everybody. You know, you, you cool with me. Like, let me know. <laughs> Join the kids, man. You subscribe. I'm trying to have the biggest vibe on YouTube. Until next time. Peace. Big old doors. From this guy in the first half. Where did that scoring explosion come from? Wow, was it really that many points? I guess it is if you say so. Uh, I'm not really concerned with my points and how I'm getting them. If I start counting points now, the rest of the games is going to get away from me. So, I'm chilling. Well done. Okay, fellas. Nice job sticking to the plan in the first half. Now, let's widen the gap and get these fans even more fired up. A big difference in this game has been our ability to not only pressure them into mistakes, but to turn those mistakes into baskets. A lot of our points have come off turnovers, and if that keeps up, we'll be in very good shape. I'll give you a compliment, though. The ball movement's been excellent. Love how many buckets we're getting off assists. And I want us pounding the offensive glass in this half. If that means sacrificing a fast break or two, so be it. It'll be worth it. These guys did not see this coming, but now they know what they're up against and they're going to come out angry. Get ready to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with them and cap this thing off.